I'm Steve Campbell, and I'm the principal tuba of the Minnesota Orchestra. I've been playing with the orchestra for 12 seasons now, and I've been playing the tuba since uh, about the age of nine. Um, and uh, I initially got interested because my dad is a tuba player and a band director. Okay, now the tuba, making a sound on the tuba starts with the mouthpiece. And a lot of people, you get, you get the question of how do you make sound on a brass instrument? All brass instruments have a mouthpiece. How do you make sound on a brass instrument? A lot of people say, well, you just blow. And if I do that, what happens? <laughs> Nothing. And then somebody say, well, you got to push the buttons or the valves. These are called valves. OK, let's try that. Blow and push the valves. <laughs> There's something missing. So what we do is we buzz our lips like this. <laughs> and then you buzz it into the mouthpiece. <laughs> and then. The, the tuba, or any brass instrument, works as an amplifier, and it, makes, makes, it projects the sound. So the tuba is like any other brass instrument. We're all, we all, we're all doing the same thing, buzzing our lips into the mouthpiece through the tubes. The tuba, a lot of times, is, is considered an umpa instrument. You'll hear the tuba do a lot of this kind of stuff. And that's all fun, and I know I'm supposed to be a tuba player because I like doing that. I like being the, you know, it's a tuba player's job a lot of times to keep the rhythm, be a part of the rhythm section of 80 or 90 people on stage. Um, but we do get to play the tune sometimes. <clears throat> Here's one that I particularly like. It's from Prokofiev's Fifth Symphony. Thanks so much for listening about the tuba today, and I hope you remain curious about all the other instruments in the orchestra, and I hope to see you sometime in Orchestra Hall.